Hello viewers, welcome to our channel Planning Basics. Today we will introduce a new version of Memovira P6 which I have already uh, get from Oracle and uh, I already upload this uh, software uh, on my Google Drive where you can get this one uh, free version and this the name of the new software is Pamovira P6 and the version is 20.12 it's a new version 2021 uh, and uh, I will also describe the which they have changed because they already changed uh, from 19.12 to 20.12 there is a, a lot of changes which they have changed before a small things like uh, a little things about documentation after a year they are uploading and they are uh, revising the entire software where we can uh, find a new windows and new options and a lot of things which they have changed so i already uh, you can find this uh, software in the video description you can copy the link and paste it to the google i already pasted here uh, in the word file just uh, select this one and uh, copy okay go to the google open google and paste here okay enter this one for the searching It's going to direct okay uh, and us okay this one this one you can download here yeah, here you can see the arrow and then underline you can click here okay downloading is start download anyway yes what he cannot scan the file from viruses there is no viruses my systems are high professionals and i am working on various softwares and this is without viruses this is already scan scan don't worry about it just download download anyway yes okay i already uninstalled to uh, to tell you people how we will install software the prime mover p6 the easy way then i already has uninstalled from my system this system and then i install again for, to tell you how we will install a new version downloading is in progress okay so viewers the oracle already changed and upload a new version as uh, uh, on 3rd of january 2020 with names uh, version name is 20.1 only what they have changed in 20.1 oracle prima miracle out help the help system region, user guides they update and the rest API documentation were updated. API documentation they updated this one, the fun thing. This is small and uh, I think most of the professionals are not using this one. They are using the documentation but this help is not they are using. Okay, the second thing they updated, the what, the what's new and cumulative feature overview have been replaced by the what's new features by release the what's new still available from the application the cumulative features overview spreadsheet is still available on oracle help center however it has been it has not been updated since 19.12 okay now they updated these things and then the third thing which they have updated in the version uh, 20.1 the third thing the client system requirements is now in html and pdf format okay html and pdf format client who is their client we are their clients okay this is the first they change and i did not up upload this one because the similar which i have already updated before okay just uh, uh, go forward move forward then i will describe again just this is downloaded okay uh, go and run directly okay 
run okay preparing to start yeah okay yes what what we will do this is welcome to prama pc professional x64 setup wizard okay next okay typical yes typical we need typical na? yes start okay prama vira p6 professional x64 okay yes i need this location okay yes new files are coming this all sample data projects and this are their captain okay the second version the revision of 20.2 version they update on 7th of february on 2020 which i already installed and i saw there is nothing to change and share with you because no nobody is doing this Uh, function of primavera what they updated i will just told you updates to reflect 20.2 changes oracle primavera cloud help user guides and rest api documentation were updated only they updated this one okay this uh, just finish this system okay go here minimize this one and refresh okay refresh 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 So here, here, and this one is Primavera V6 X64. Uh, open this one. Double click on it. Okay, open. just uh, edit database configuration okay we are going to edit database configuration first you will add because you cannot use without this database uh, database uh, configuration okay first of all driver type type this what they have changed before we are doing in the previous versions we are doing in the same window first we give this database inputs and then even finish to install now they separate these things with after the selection of software you have to edit this one okay now we will which we will select the primavera uh, driver type this is p6 pro stand alone sq lite okay select like this one okay database alias pmdb okay we will add a new new stand alone database and connection okay go to the next okay here this is my name this is login name what you want to right you will write if you want to write your name admin something else your project name you can you can okay i will just write here as a password a d m i n admin okay then again a d m i n admin that is I will repeat this one, and now you have to give here the base currency. What which currency you want to use? Now I am using the US dollars, but there is option in in the Primavera software. You can change there, but you can write here your currency like uh, which I have Pakistani rupees, Pakistani. uh pakistani currency symbol is p sorry p p k r and then abbreviation what is the abbreviation of the pakistani currency this is p k r what type you want which is your currency you will write here most commonly the peoples are using the us dollars right way 
US they are using the US DO dollar dollar okay and then symbol the the symbol same I am just again going to back to, to the same one because I am also using the dollar currency okay abbreviation USD okay then go next okay this is the same location okay save already yes already adjust if you want to remove or overwrite it's okay okay you can see alias is saved successfully okay okay just close this one this window close and then put here your password admin admin connect Congratulations, you can see your new version here, Primavera P6 Professional 20.12, no current project, we will do, but now we just uh, go through whatever, what they change from, what is the travel history from 19.12 to 20.12 version okay as you can see here this is the sample project which i have already uploaded in the primavera with where you can practice each and everything if you want to see the currency here which you have changed just go to the column and insert one find okay uh, actual total total Cost. you can confirm your currency just from here the which you have selected there is this is here or not okay apply okay I selected again the dollars that's why dollars here otherwise if you are doing uh, PKR, Rials, uh, Dirham whatever it will become same okay so then they again uh, we dis, uh, discuss about 20.2 and then they updated the 20.3 on 6th March 2020 the same changes just they updated Oracle Primal Miracle of Help, User Guides and REST API documentation were updated and then 20.4 on 3rd of April 2020 they just updated Oracle Primal Miracle of Help, User Guide and REST API documentation were updated and then 20.5 they on 1st of may 2020 oracle primavera cloud help user guides and rest api documentation were updated okay then on 10th of june 2020 update they reflect uh, the 20.6 version oracle primavera cloud help user guides rest api documentation were updated and then uh, they updated the getting started for the application administration had been added help first time to administration negative initial setup says the progress user guide has been as been added to the library and accommodate the new progress license the file management extensions user guide has been removed from the library as the functionality has been removed from the application they remove the file management system in this version because it's troubling to use the software then they uh, introduce the new version 20.7 for primavera p6 on 10th of july 2020 oracle primavera cloud help user guides and rest api documentation the same thing they updated in 20 uh, in 20.8 version the same and in 20.9 the same 20.10 the same and 21.11 the same the 11 20.11 they updated on 6 november 2020 
what they updated in 20.12 they updated some of their keys to shortcuts layouts uh, and then which i have already described the window for separate for database settings because if you are installing a software in previous version if you are getting the trouble then you have not installed whenever you get help from anywhere you can install again and again it take time now they separate the database window first of all you have to install the software then you will install the database and configure the system and give your password it is otherwise this is good step and then this uh, this windows they updated the windows administration of the software one two and third thing is they update and upgrade the document system the entire because they are entire updating the whole system up to here oracle is updating that's why they updated this is third thing and the fourth thing they are updated the getting started application administrators okay these are things and two many other small 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 things they updated when you enjoy when you will enjoy you uh, when you will use you will enjoy the new software it's totally free you can just go get link and install this software and please subscribe channel planning p6 and tell us how we are going positive or negative we are waiting for your comment thank you allah hafiz